Hey guys, how you doing? Not just survival. What's going on? Happy New Year. So like I said, today we're going to be doing a review on the Kershaw Blur. This one's in olive drab with the black DLC coated blade. Good looking knife. Very good looking knife. Probably one of my favorite Kershaws. I also have a Kershaw Leak, which is also a, a neat design. Um, get into the specs here on this. This is um, rated at 3.9 ounces for the weight. It's running a 14C28N steel. Like I said, it's a DLC black coated blade. Yeah, there you go. 3.9 ounces is not too bad. Um, blade length on this. I'm not prepared for that one. We'll get back to that. 3.9 Oh, 3.4 inch blade length. It is a um, an assisted knife. Spring assisted. They call it a speed safe spring assisted knife. What that means for you non-knife people is that uh, there's a spring here that assists it to open. So when you click it, it just pops open a little easier once you get it past the retention point, I guess, right about there. That just pops open. Um, this is a uh, tip-down carry knife. And it has these, uh, it looks like skateboard tape. What the heck do they call it? They call it a... A track tech inserts on these on this knife. Track tech insert skateboard tape. Um, it's got an aluminum body. It's got pillar design. It's a liner lock knife. You see there, it's got the liner lock, and it comes with a bunch of uh, in a bunch of different colors. You can get the blade and like an asset wash. And first all knives do come very sharp from the factory. This one is still has a nice nice edge. Oh, a little bit tearing. If I stop it a little I bet yeah I can get it real sharp. It's definitely, definitely one of my favorite, one of my favorite pocket knives. All right, take it easy, guys. We're gonna have some more stuff coming up on the channel. Maybe we'll get into some Ontario knives, maybe some Buck knives. All right, guys, catch you later. Thanks.